y'all welcome to CC's Texas Garden guys we're on a mission we're on a mission to find a snake <laughs> yeah and if he gets out the garden I'm cool with that if he decide he want to keep running around in the garden they ain't gonna be cool I came out here before I was headed to work to water the garden because we have been in the 80s mercy we have been in the 80s and so that means a lot more watering and uh he was sitting there sunbathing <laughs> just straight sunbathing on my t on, on my um peppers he was just laying there and I seen him the same time he seen me and I had the water hose so when I turned I like kind of sprayed him and then he like ran off behind my pots not happy with that but I have my garden dog with me now he is a rat and mouse wrangler he catch some flies too I don't know what he would do if he catch a snake you know but I like having him in the garden because uh yeah I'm not scared of snakes y'all if that's you know you new to the channel um, I have been known to be called a snake slayer <laughs> and yes they're probably grass snakes garden snakes but they in the garden they have plenty of land outside this garden and I know they want to eat my little froggy friends and I know no, I like my froggy friends. They eat the insects. The snake's going to be letting the insects eat my food. Right? So while we out here, we're going to be kind of looking at stuff and looking for him. Okay? So let me know. He is, he's a garter snake. He's about two feet long. You might see just the tip of him or something while we're looking around. Let me know. Okay, uh, I want to start off here, y'all. Look at my corn. My corn was scaring me. I was like, oh, if CC Texas Garden don't have corn for my viewers, if I can sit out here and eat some fresh corn, it's going to be a sad day. <laughs> but they're coming up. Look at that. They are coming up. I'm, I'm glad they were struggling for a little bit. Around here, I have some dragon tongue green beans on that back row they're getting little beans and then what kind is this over here some other kind of bean bush beans over here see little tiny green beans so yeah we have that and uh like i said i don't know where he could have been snuck off that was early this morning when i went to work it could be under any little cart any other little yeah he could be anywhere oh i also have some tomatoes right here that are finally doing good they got some little blossoms on them so uh look at my little cactus she is showing out look at that oh she's so pretty and my dragon fruit looking beautiful okay so we're gonna look around there's my mullein. Nope. Why I say mullein? There is my borage. This is my borage that I grew in my hydroponics. Look at it. She's looking beautiful. My leaf of life. It likes being in a pot of dirt. So, so. <laughs> she likes it. Now, this snake could be all up in there. Probably. Hopefully not. I'm going to show y'all where I've seen it. But I also need to make sure that she or he is not laying up in this bed. Just like, you know, because they kind of be camouflaged when you don't be looking for them. But I did want to show y'all. It's time to do a green bean harvest again. Look at that long thing. Oh, shoot. Look, look at that. That girl got, that girl growing some green beans. Look at that. Wait, hold up. Y'all can't see. Green beans. That's what I'm talking That's That's what I'm talking about. Uh-huh. Yeah. 
<laughs> look at that. Look at all that back there. Look. Look at them green beans. Oh, shoes. You got to pull them off of there before, you know, they be trying to go to seed or something. Oh, yeah. You got not just a few. There, look, look, all up in there. Got the tree, I uh, got the little pepper. <sighs> got the green bean bush all leaning. Mm -hmm. This is my dragon fruit here. All these ones with just like lime green color. Those are all new. Because they like where they live. <laughs> okay. Tomatoes. I guess with this 80 degree heat, tomatoes are kicking in like yeah it's that time it's that time i haven't figured out where i'm gonna put these yet <laughs> these i don't know even how many cantaloupe mm, mm, mm. and they finna get to their second leaf oh mercy okay so this she gonna have to come down i'm just waiting let me show you let me bring y'all over here Okay, who been digging hole? That snake might be down this hole. Cause I ain't seen that hole this morning. That's why I think she got in or he got in from one of these crawfish holes. But anyway, you see, can y'all see the little pods? That's what I'm waiting on. I need this pod to get a little bigger, fatter, and then I'm gonna go ahead and cut this down. Cause girl getting ate up with the aphids just yeah yeah she got some stuff going on with her down there <laughs> all right uh what what we got going on here don't be trying to hide i see y'all trying to mate on my what is these hold up what kind of beetles are these and they hiding Y'all see them? Oh, and they fly. Look at these. Get off there. And the other ones was mating. Let me show you. Look, look, they trying to hide. How you pull her around there that fast? Look at that. They over here, I don't even know what kind of bugs them is. Are they good or bad bugs? They running though. All right, that's enough of that. These I put peppers all in here. These are not the pepper bed that I seen the snake on. Now, where I seen the snake this morning, see these little bricks right here, these cinder block? It was just laid across there. Just straight sun tanning. Like, uh-uh. Yeah. And I don't have my hole in my hand right now, so it got a fair running chance. <laughs> right now, I'm just searching. I'm not, you know. Look at this beautiful borage. Y'all look at that. Look at that. That's the one that I planted with my little um, auger that I got from Timu. And I planted the girl in there. And she's like, yep, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Look at her, look at her flower. That was like... I love the color on that. Love the color. This is my gardening dog, Domino. Domino, you my gardening dog? Are you gonna be a snake slayer like your your owner? Huh? Are you gonna be a snake slayer too? You know, you cannot let the snake just sit up there and uh pass you by and be like, what was that? <laughs> okay, I need you to do a job if you're gonna stay up in here with me. <laughs> all right um i was gonna tell y'all because I, I need to figure out if these i gotta go back on my video because i can't remember if these are garlics or onions garlics or onions that i planted in this bed so i have to go back on videos and see but as you can see all these little bottom things are gone I mean they didn't dried up that means i think when you just like the third level i can harvest them and i put these in in november all these ones are back in november 
maybe October. I, I got to go look back and see. So, uh, I think it's about harvest time. Oh, look at the, look at the tomatoes, y'all. What? This is a Tom, no, is this the Tiny Tim? This was in my hydroponics. Don't you knock it off of there, dude. Um, <laughs> this was in my hydroponics and I put it outside and it is doing wonderful. No, sir, there's nothing to eat. You don't, no, don't eat them. But look at all my little cherry tomatoes. Look at this. This is too little. Be trying to not stop. I don't have no nothing to snack on right now. No garden snacks. Okay, we'll get some strawberries in a minute. He loves strawberries, y'all. Mm -hmm. He does. Look at this. Already putting little buds on. That's tiny. That's the little candy roaster. <laughs> it was like I am going to try to have babies. All right. I don't know where that stupid snake. Well, let me see. So the snake came and it went around that way. And I was like, hmm, I wonder where you went. And then I seen the bottom of his tail right there on this cardboard. So he could most likely be under this um, little deck thing that I have for these plants. He probably under there. But he better not come out while I'm in here. Uh, while we here, y'all look, this my blue butterfly, my blue, blue, blue butterfly pea. So, um, I only got one day off this week. Not nice, not fair at all, but whatever. <laughs> Check would be nice, but right now I'm like, ah, you know, mad about it. Okay, but I need to get a trellis for these blue butterfly pea and my loofahs um, somewhere. I'm thinking I'm gonna probably do a trellis over this area. This won't be here. That big mama, she'll be gone. And I'm thinking, I just don't know how tall it needs to be. I need a, I need a cattle panel. I need, I have to talk to somebody. I need one. Just a nice arch. Maybe at the front. Um, right there would be an arch. Somewhere. For my beautiful blue butterfly pea. I can't wait. I got these seeds from my bestie. She's amazing. Okay. This need to come out too soon. I need to harvest it. It doesn't have any... um bugs or pests on it but it's just it's blocking stuff look it's blocking look at these big old whatever they are onions maybe my this is my echinacea right there they they like being in some soil yep my echinacea coming up i'm gonna come around here where that snake was because i want to show y'all my mystery tomato bed this is the one that none of the tomatoes had came up. A whole tray of the, like different ones. And then I was like, I'm going to use this soil. And as soon as I put it in the bed, they became tomatoes. Yeah. So I don't know what kind of tomatoes. I can tell this one probably indeterminate because that boy is big. Look at that. Ooh, I got to harvest them out. And put them in their own containers. And look at this. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I gotta harvest my onions. These are my green onions, multiplying onions, whatever you want to call them. I am going to make um, some uh, green onion powder. So I'm gonna dehydrate all of them and make green onion powder. All right. Um, here is my uh, what kind of mm, oh my kusha oh I got a baby kusha look at that yeah my baby kusha yes oh look at this girl I don't think you got pollinated oh man 
Yep, these are my cooch. I see another one back there. So the females are out. Okay. Very good. I really want to know what these are, y'all. Let's dig down here and just see if it's a garlic or onion. That would be an onion. That look like an onion. What does that look like to God? That look like an onion. So, I think it needs to be a little bigger though. I wonder what you are. Wait, first of all, I'm gonna check under here because you know, that'd be a place a snake like to be hiding. Let's see, no snake, okay. Let's start digging. Let's see what this is. Ouch. Ew. Well, what is it? Onion? I guess it's gonna be an onion, y'all. I'm guessing, but it's not ready yet. I don't know why I wanna pull this one up. I don't know. <laughs> it's an onion. <laughs> Sorry, onion, you ain't ready. Okay. There you go. You're good. Okay. I am going to start planting some things, some more stuff in here. I know I got carrots kind of sprawled out, but that'd be okay. Um, that is my borage that was smothered in the mud. It's doing good. This lady bok choy, I'm about to pull her out. She is getting ate up. She getting ate up and I don't think she's gonna get any bigger. I need to pull her out. But I want to show y'all my grapes, y'all. Now some of these grapes, they did not make it. Look at that. See they all dried up. But it's still got some on there. And look. So this is what they look like, I guess, after they got pollinated. Yeah, the little flowers came. And now this is what they're looking like. And they're getting bigger. So that must mean that they were pollinated. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Are we gonna have grapes, y'all? Or are we going to have some grapes? Look at that. Mm-mm. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Grapes, take your time. Take your time. So I'm over here. Um, we have some acorn squash. I know I should have took this other one out of there. They can't be in there together. Buttercup squash. Patty pans. Peanuts. So these are my uh, Virginia Jumbo peanuts. Yeah. We're going to see if we can grow some peanuts in Texas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alrighty, and we have tomatoes back here, Roma, big boy, I don't think they're doing the best, I think I probably need to move them somewhere where they get some sun, this is kind of overshadowing them, and they're not going to get the sun they really need, um, I have my pigeon pea right here, look at my pigeon pea getting taller, now these get big like trees, so it cannot stay in that container. No, it cannot. Look at my zinnias. Gorgeous, aren't they? Yep. Okay. I have a sunflower coming up right there. My uh, blackberry, my thornless blackberry bush. They're starting, the berries are starting to get that red tint to them. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm going to eat them all. So. <laughs> so. Train. Oh, I got one more thing. Sorry, y'all. I just looked over there and I'm like, this is special. Okay, graduated this far in the video, 
If you did, make sure that you give me a thumbs up. And in the comment, I'm going to tell you what to say. Okay? Let me turn you around. I just seen it the other day. Now, this is my purple galaxy tomato. Right? And this thing, it is mixed. It is a tomato mixed with a, um, a dragon what is it mixed with a uh, dragon not dragon fruit um uh, bag, dragon flower what, what is it called anyway so it has like this weird like it got froze you know like if plants got too cold or whatever and they got this like purplish color but Anyway, the main thing is, look. Y'all see that? <laughs> we have a tomato. Now, I've had all these. You see all these? These are just, they died. I don't know what was going on. They just did not create nothing. And I tapped the flowers and did all that. And it just did not make it. But this baby here, look at that. I am so excited and it has other blooms on here so but I want to see this beautiful purple tomato so in the comments if you stayed this long in the video um, put purple don't put purple tomato just put purple and all see right, how guys, many I'm gonna get off here I am tired I've been at work all day and uh, thank y'all for being a part of my channel thank you for all the new subscribers that i've been getting thank y'all for coming here and loving on your girl in texas and um i'm gonna see y'all on the next video okay